I've lived in this neighborhood for 57 years, and this is one of the most exciting things that could happen. It will boost up the pride that we have in each other as individuals and as a collective community. At the Heights, brighter futures are within reach. In a few short years, up to 1,000 new families will call the Greater East Side their home. Another 1,000 residents will have access to good paying jobs with low barriers to entry. Those who live, work, or visit the area will enjoy a new five acre park, expanded trail connections, and other outdoor amenities our residents deserve. With public and private contributions, the 112-acre Hillcrest Golf Club is well on its way to becoming an environmentally friendly neighborhood asset with plenty to offer residents now and into the future. The Heights promises to be the largest modern-day investment in St. Paul's East Side. The Heights will be divided into two distinct sections, housing and light industrial. I'm really excited for the opportunity for residents to access new and better employment in a place where there hasn't been much employment before. By locating directly where folks live and close to where folks want to live and want to be working, you're accessing a population of job seekers that you wouldn't have access to out in the suburbs. I think what a lot of people don't realize is all of our housing and residential development on the east side is great. But without commercial and industrial tax base, a lot of that tax burden then falls on all of us as homeowners and as people who are living in that residential housing. We need tax base in St. Paul and on the east side, which will provide relief to all of the residential taxpayers who see their taxes going up year after year. These jobs will also give area residents the opportunity to build wealth with better access to stable jobs close to home, low barriers to entry, above average pay, competitive employee benefits, and clean, safe work environments. I'd like to say I was really smart when I moved to East St. Paul, but I had no idea what I was getting into in a good way. I have this huge labor pool and it's worked out really well. There's a lot of people who want to work in this neighborhood and who are ready to work and looking for an opportunity. It's, it's really important. There are a lot of families in our area that a family of four that would make $35,000 or less. And that's a tough, tough goal for a lot of these families. So that would mean a lot when these jobs paid $22, $23 or more an hour. That'd be very uplifting to them. People are going to want to come do their job. They're going to want to apply for those jobs, especially when it's right next door. There's jobs where it's like it, it takes a lot out of your gas, insurance, you have to have a vehicle. You, you have more of a reliable community when it's right there that you can go to work. I think that's what we've, we've been missing on the east side is that investment uh, from our own neighbors and from our businesses. So I think once we get those in, it'll really just lift everybody up.